Hey everyone, Brandon here with Galloway Precision. Today we're going to go over the installation of the Plus 9 mag extension for the Taurus TX-22 series of pistols. Uh, what you're going to get is you're going to get the extension, the locking plate, and a new spring. Alright, so uh, let's go over tools you're going to need. You're going to need your polymer hammer and a 332nd punch. And that's it. So let's go ahead and lock and clear it. We are visually and physically empty. We'll take our mag out and we're going to set our pistol off to the side. First thing we're going to do is take our magazine, turn it upside down. You'll take your 332nd. You'll push in on the locking plate while pushing off the base pad. Now keep in mind <clears throat> that this thing is under spring tension, so keep your thumb over it. We're going to move the old locking plate and spring, set them off to the side. We're going to open our new spring and get it ready. All right, but first we're going to take out our set screw that keeps the mag from moving, which it's going to be a very tight fit for some mags, hence why we brought our hammer along. So if you get to a point where it's getting real hard to push it on, just tap it flush. All right, got a little more to go. There we go. The lop follower came out. You're going to be reusing your stock follower, by the way. So drop that back down in there. We'll go ahead and put our mag spring in. And now we're going to put on our locking plate. Now, I already had these started. They'll probably ship unstarted. Just uh, the three long screws that you're going to receive. Go in the locking plate. The short screw is the set screw for the front. So, I already have this one prepped, but you'll probably get them um, in different baggies. We literally just pulled this thing off the press. I was like, ooh, video time. All right, so we're going to take our locking plate. going to line up on the spring. We're going to compress the spring. And we're going to start doing our set screws. I like to do the front one first. All right, and don't tighten it all the way down because you want to make sure that it's lined up because it will shift. So you want to make sure that you get one of the other ones started so that it's in the correct mounting hole. And then we're just going to tighten them all down hand tight. Okay. Don't need to crank on it. Let's get it down hand tight. All right, we're ready to put our set screw on. I usually get one or two threads started because you can kind of get away with using the Allen wrench. If you got a ball end, it'll make it a lot easier for you. But if you're using a flat end like me, once you get it started, you know the drill. Just take your Allen. Start on one side, go to the other until you've got it flush with the top of the extension. All right, we're hand tight. That's all you need to do. Now, the fun part. One. Now I have a weird skin disease that's rest from moving my video stuff out to the Kydex cabin. Stabbing cabin, if you will. <laughs> Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Oh. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 
habit. You don't really need to do that. I just do it. 22. 23. It's getting a little tough to load. 24. This is when you're going to want to use your loader it comes with. And 25. Clear. Safety's on. Locks right in on a closed slide. So 25 plus 1. Of course, it's not going to work that way, but you get the idea. I'm never going to find these now. Whee! And that's it. 25 rounds, some of which are probably all over the place now. But there you go, guys. The Plus 9. It's ready to roll. It's going to be going up on the website today, tomorrow, soon. Um, probably will be up by the time you actually watch this. And that's going to wrap it up, guys. So if you guys got any questions, feel free to email me at tech. That's Tango Echo Charlie Hotel at GallowayPrecision.com. Be sure to follow us on social media. Links will be in the description. And as always, be safe, be accurate, and God bless.